Before the boy became a vampire, his name was Damien. He grew up in the small town of Ravenswood, a place where everyone seemed to know everyone else. Damien was an introverted and sensitive soul, passionate about books and art. However, these qualities made him an easy target for the bullies at his high school. The torment began when Damien was just a young boy, enduring taunts, ridicule, and physical abuse from his peers. His attempts to fit in or seek help from adults were met with indifference or, worse, further ridicule. The bullying escalated as he entered high school, with his tormentors finding new and creative ways to make his life miserable. Damien's isolation grew, and he found solace in the darkness of his room, immersing himself in literature and art to escape the harsh reality outside. His only confidant was his love for the mysterious and supernatural, finding comfort in tales of creatures that held power and exacted revenge on those who wronged them. As the years passed, the relentless bullying took a toll on Damien's mental health. He became a shell of his former self, unable to stand up for himself or fight back against the tormentors who seemed to delight in his suffering. The cruelty of his peers fueled a growing resentment within him, nurturing a dark seed of vengeance. One fateful night, as Damien walked home alone through the dimly lit streets, he caught the attention of a vampire who had been watching the town from the shadows. The vampire, sensing Damien's despair and rage, saw an opportunity for a companion who shared its thirst for revenge. Without warning, the vampire attacked Damien, sinking its fangs into his neck and infusing him with the dark gift of immortality. As the vampire's venom coursed through Damien's veins, his body underwent a transformation and he emerged from the encounter reborn as a creature of the night, hungry for revenge. The boy who had once been helpless and bullied now possessed supernatural powers that would allow him to turn the tables on his tormentors. Little did the town of Ravens would know that Damien's transformation into a vampire marked the beginning of a chilling tale that would unfold in the shadows of their own fears and insecurities. Damien, now a creature of the night, embraced the darkness that coursed through his veins, the insatiable thirst for blood fueled his every move, and he reveled in the newfound strength that allowed him to strike fear into the hearts of his tormentors. Under the cover of night, Damien hunted down each bully with ruthless precision. His attacks were brutal, leaving a trail of pale, lifeless bodies in his wake. The town, gripped by fear, struggled to comprehend the malevolent force that had descended upon them. Damien's vengeance knew no bounds. He taunted his victims relishing in their terror before draining the life from their trembling bodies. The once quiet and introverted boy had transformed into a bloodthirsty predator, a phantom haunting the nightmares of those who had wronged him. As the town descended further into chaos, rumors and whispers of the vengeful vampire circulated. Panic spread like wildfire, and the streets were empty after sunset. As the residents cowered behind locked doors, praying they wouldn't be the next prey of the night. Yet, with each act of revenge, Damien felt an emptiness within him. The darkness that had consumed his soul left him yearning for something more. The line between justice and vengeance blurred, and the once tormented boy found himself questioning the very nature of his existence. In the shadows, a group of vampire hunters, known for their relentless pursuit of supernatural threats, closed in on Damien. Unbeknownst to him, a formidable adversary lurked in the darkness studying his every move and preparing for a confrontation that would determine the fate of the cursed town. As Damien continued his nocturnal reign of terror, the hunters closed the distance, their determination matching the intensity of his thirst for vengeance. The stage was set for a deadly showdown, and the town of Ravenswood held its breath, caught between the terror of the night and the impending clash that would decide the fate of the bloodthirsty vampire boy. The night air in Ravens would thicken with tension as Damien continued his merciless spree of vengeance. His name spread like a whispered curse, striking fear into the hearts of the townspeople. The once serene community now existed in a perpetual state of dread, haunted by the bloodthirsty shadow that prowled the darkness. Damien, now fully immersed in his vampiric nature, began to feel a dark power stirring within him. His senses sharpened, and an eerie connection with the night enveloped him. As he reveled in the chaos he wrought, a mysterious force seemed to beckon him towards a darker destiny. Unbeknownst to Damien, the vampire hunters tracking his every move were led by a figure shrouded in mystery. This hunter, known only as Valyria, possessed an ancient knowledge of the supernatural. Her eyes, hardened by countless encounters with creatures of the night, 
held a determination that matched Damien's thirst for revenge. The confrontation between Damien and the hunters became inevitable. Valeria, with her enigmatic past and formidable skills, moved with a purpose that hinted at a personal connection to the world of the supernatural. As the two forces hurtled towards a collision, the town became a battleground, a macabre stage for a showdown that would decide the fate of Ravenswood. Meanwhile, the darkness within Damien continued to grow. The emptiness that gnawed at his undead soul intensified, driving him to explore the depths of his newfound powers. The vampire boy, once fueled solely by a desire for retribution, now grappled with the ominous force that compelled him towards an unknown destiny. The townspeople, caught between the terror of a bloodthirsty creature and the impending clash of supernatural forces, wondered if salvation or damnation awaited them. The night air hung heavy with uncertainty as the stage was set for a finale that promised to unravel the mysteries hidden in the shadows of Ravenswood. As the night in Ravenswood descended into a symphony of terror, Damien's attacks grew more calculated and ruthless. The town's once proud streets now echoed with the anguished cries of those who fell prey to the bloodthirsty vampire boy. Damien reveled in the chaos, his laughter mingling with the night winds, a haunting melody that sent shivers down the spines of those who dared to listen. In the midst of the darkness, Valeria and her group of vampire hunters closed in on Damien. Their footsteps were silent, their determination unwavering. Valeria, a figure of mystery with a past entwined with the supernatural, felt an unsettling connection to the very essence that fueled Damien's malevolence. Her steely gaze betrayed no emotion, but her every move hinted at a personal vendetta that transcended the mere eradication of a vampire threat. As the town awaited the inevitable clash between the vengeful vampire and the seasoned hunters, a clandestine force stirred in the shadows, Unseen eyes watched the unfolding drama with an interest that went beyond the mortal realm. Whispers of an ancient prophecy murmured through the winds, hinting at a destiny that had long been entwined with the fates of both hunter and hunted. Meanwhile, within Damien's undead heart, a conflict raged, the insatiable thirst for revenge that had driven him to embrace the darkness now warred within. Unseen force that beckoned him towards an uncertain future, his nocturnal existence became a labyrinth of conflicting desires, and a sinister power whispered promises of unimaginable strength in exchange for a surrender to the shadows. The town, gripped by fear and uncertainty, stood at the precipice of a nightmarish revelation. The air crackled with tension, and the moon cast an eerie glow over the impending confrontation. Ravenswood, once a haven, had become a battleground for supernatural forces and the final chapter of this blood-soaked tale awaited its unsettling conclusion. The night in Ravenswood reached its zenith as the forces of darkness clashed in a frenzied ballet of predator and prey. Damien, the once tormented boy turned bloodthirsty vampire, faced off against Valeria and her group of determined vampire hunters. The air crackled with an electric tension, and the moon bore witness to the final act of a macabre drama. As the battle unfolded, a sudden chill swept through the night freezing the combatants in their tracks. Unseen eyes observed the chaos, and an ancient presence, long dormant, awoke. Whispers of an ancient prophecy materialized, as if the very fabric of fate trembled in the balance. In that moment, Damien felt a surge of power unlike anything he had ever experienced. The shadows embraced him, and an otherworldly force coursed through his veins. Valeria, equally touched by a mysterious power, sensed a connection that transcended the immediate conflict. A momentary pause settled upon the battlefield, as if both sides were bound by threads of destiny they could not fully comprehend. Just as the confrontation seemed on the verge of a cataclysmic resolution, the ancient presence intervened. A voice, resonating from the depths of time, spoke words that echoed through the night. The prophecy remained shrouded in ambiguity, leaving the fate of Ravenswood hanging in a delicate balance. With a mysterious force guiding their actions, both Damien and Valeria recoiled from the brink of a devastating conclusion. The town, caught in the crossfire of supernatural forces, witnessed a surreal to blow as the combatants retreated into the shadows. The night, once filled with terror, gradually settled into an uneasy calm. The ancient presence lingered, leaving behind a town forever changed by the events that had unfolded. Damien and Valeria, haunted by unanswered questions, vanished into the night, their destinies intertwined by forces beyond mortal comprehension. Ravenswood, left in the aftermath of an enigmatic clash, 
stood at the threshold of an uncertain future, the moon cast its silvery glow over the town, revealing the remnants of a nightmarish tale that had unfolded in the shadows. The conclusion remained elusive, as if the story had merely entered a new chapter, veiled in mystery and waiting to be unraveled by those bold enough to seek the truth.